Um, I'd say it's a whole change of environment we are seeking after. I did have strong passion for what I studied, which was aerospace engineering, but I was very interested in IT um, as it's a booming industry, especially in this part of the world. So when I came back to Malaysia, I decided I want to go into technology consulting. Hi, my name is Paul and I studied aerospace engineering at the University of Bristol. My current role is an analyst within the technical architecture team of Accenture. Um, even for my mom, she questioned me why did I change to apply for a job which I didn't study in university. But I told her and defended my point strongly that um, I'm, I would be able to learn. Um, it's a very fast moving environment where the amount I learned in a short period of time would definitely benefit me. And the skills I learned in this industry is transferable to any other industry as IT is a very strong and uh, coming up industry. Um, yes, um, I would definitely consider going back into aerospace engineering. Reason being is that um, I've always had a strong interest in aircrafts and in spacecraft. But the only reason holding me back is because I'm enjoying my time at Accenture. I'm enjoying my job in the IT industry. So unless there's a reason for me to choose to go back into the aerospace industry, I wouldn't do so. Because the IT industry is a very fast-moving industry, one of the strongest skills I've learned um, day to day is actually to prioritise your tasks and more importantly, to manage people's expectations. Everyone will never have an unending work, but the point is, you need to know how to prioritise it against importance and urgency as well. Um, from this, I'm able to complete the important tasks every day um, as I carry out my daily tasks and I'm able to transfer these skills to even my daily life and to any other society I'm handling. <laughs>